from a user standpoint, it's obvious, right? You live in the residential and you work in the industrial, but from a financial point of view, it's where can you get your most bang for your buck, right? So, and what what do you understand most? So from a pure number standpoint, residential and industrial, I don't know which one is better in the long run. I guess it depends on what the critical mass of ownership is. Like Black, you know, Blackstone is owning, you know, thousands of tens of thousands of units. That's heavy management, but they're geared towards that. Then there are other guys who they look at the industrial. They don't want multi-tenant industrial. They want big box, single unit, net lease type buildings. You know, a million square feet, 10 tenants. A million square feet, two tenants. Less management, easy to maintain, very simple, but they're, they're you know, geared towards that. <laughs>